paradise put up the parking lot the pink hotel the boutique and a swinging hot spot don't it always seem to go you don't know what you got till it's not the pink paradise put up the parking lot Pull the trees, put them in a train museum And we charge the people a dollar and a half just the same Don't it always seem to go You don't know what you got till it's gone We pay paradise, put up the parking lot We pay paradise, put up the parking lot We pay paradise, put up the parking lot How's it going folks, this is Wayne Arbat back with another lesson and an amazing song as always today we're looking at the great Joni Mitchell and Big Yellow Taxi famously covered by Counting Crows so my version somewhere in the middle of the Joni Mitchell and the Counting Crows version uh, now I know Joni Mitchell plays this in a completely different tuning this is a way that you can play it by using a capo in standard tuning I play it at my shows like this, think it works really well uh, it's pretty much all open chords, so I think most sort of advanced beginners could get this one down. So it's a great song to stick into your uh, into your set, uh, or if you're uh, you know just playing for fun or barbecues, or you're a campfire guitarist, this is a great one to get down. Great classic this one. Now, if you do want the chords and lyrics to this, as always, I'm going to post it up on my Patreon page. I'll also add the strumming pattern on there, as I always do. And if you want to get access to that, I'm going to post a link up in the description. I'll also put a link in the comments. And the way that that works, you just click on the link, sign up for as little as a couple of quid a month or however much you want to pledge. It's all very much appreciated. All generally all goes back into the lessons. And it gives you guys access to not only this song, pretty much everything I've done over the past coming up to three years now. So there's a lot of content up there if you want to go and check that out. There's also some exclusive videos that aren't on YouTube. There's a lot of videos I regularly post up from the archive. And there's stuff to coincide with the technique lessons I've done. So if you're into the scales and the blues stuff that I quite often do, you know, little different things here and there, the stuff to coincide with that. So what you're waiting for, link in the comments, link in the description. If you don't want to do that, I've got a new feature, which is a super thanks link. It's just under the video there. You can click on that, make a small donation. Again, very much appreciated. And another thing that's very much appreciated, thanks everyone who's subscribed and continues to do so. Thanks for taking the time to watch my uh, my stuff that I put out. I really appreciate that. Now, if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, a further way you could help me out and yourselves out is by hitting that little notification bell that's just under the video there so you can keep up to date with all the videos that I put out. And another way that you can help me out, or uh, if, you, if you're interested, please go over and give me a like on social media. So I'm Wayne Arguitar on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and I'll also TikTok, as you always say. I'm trying to get down with the kids. Anyway, that's enough of me rambling. Without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so the song and this version that I'm actually showing you today is in standard tuning, but as you can see, you're going to want the capo up on the second fret, okay? Just while I'm talking about capos, I'd like to give the G7th Capo Company a quick plug. I'm not on any kind of endorsement deal or anything like that. They were just kind enough to send me a capo over. Um, now, we already own the Performance 2 model in silver. This is a Performance 3 model. It's got my name sort of inscripted on the top. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, but what I would say, I've had the Performance 2 model for the best part, you know, coming up to 17 years now, and it's never let me down. It's a great, light, you know, reliable, strong capo. It's never lost its grip. So if you are on the market for a capo, I'm just going to put a link to that in the description. That's a G7 capo, and this particular version is a Performance 3 model. So there we go. Okay, so the uh, intro to this, now really there's just the intro, there's a verse, a chorus, and then just a little interlude, and that's pretty much the same throughout the song then, so once we get the verse and the chorus, you know, the little interlude which is just staying on the D chord, we've pretty much got the song, okay? So we're, the intro is going to be a G chord, it's up to you what G you use, I personally like to use the four finger G, we go to an A chord. And then we're going to go to a D. But what I do on the D, I keep adding this little embellishment in. That's just adding my little pinky on and off the third fret on the top E string, just underneath the third finger there. So we get this. Okay, so I'm going to talk about the strumming and the dynamics as I go along. Now, what I do in the intro is sort of just sort of down strokes to start off with. So it's like down, 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 down. Same on the A. 
Now when we go into the D, we start strumming, so... And the strumming pattern I tend to use once I'm strumming this song is a down, down, up, down, up, down, down, down. So that'd be on the chords that go for a bar, chords that go half a bar, down, down, down. Okay, okay, so I'll just play that uh, intro one more time just so you can hear that. Obviously, we got the. Okay, and the chords to the verse are going to be a G chord. Then we're going to go to a D, we're going to go back to the G, and then we're going to do an A chord, and then to a D, okay? So I'm just going to sing that through so you can see how that gels together. So we've got, they pay paradise, put up the parking lot, to the pink hotel, the booty can swing in hard spots. So when I, another thing, when I go to that D, sometimes I'll add a D sus to a nice little embellishment just taking that you know, that second finger on and off. So that's gonna be a verse. Uh, when we go to the chorus, now the first two lines of the chorus, uh, Joni sort of does it with single strum, so I'm keeping it quite true to the song. And the chords are gonna be a D chord, a D major seven. So if you've never seen that before, I'd just do that by barring the top three strings on the E, the B and the G string, and we also play the open D string. Then we got this chord that's called a G slash D. Harder than it sounds, all of that is one finger on the third fret on the top E string relative to the capo. Again, we're gonna play the top four strings from the open D downwards. Okay, then we go to a D, and then the strumming comes in, we got G, A, and then D. Okay, so I'm just gonna sing that chorus through so you can see how that gels together. So we got, Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone. They play paradise, but up the parking lot. Okay, and the little interlude between, you know, the chorus and the verses there, it's just the D, sort of that embellishment on the D sus4. So what we get is... Okay, now that just keeps repeating pretty much throughout the song, okay? Uh, the last chorus, it just repeats that, uh, that last phrase about three times. So if we sing it as if we're doing the last chorus, it'll go um, Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you got till it's gone You play paradise, put up the parking lots They play paradise, put up the parking lots They play paradise, put up the parking lots Let me finish there on the D chord And that is pretty much all you're going to need Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. I like to keep my channel as diverse as possible. So one week you might get something from ABBA, the next week you might get something from ACDC. I don't know. I'm not fussy. If music's good, it's good. You know what I mean? And this is a great song. I absolutely love this track. So uh, there we go. Hope you all dug that version. Uh, if you've got any other requests for anything, you know, 50s to modern day, you know how diverse I am. So I'll take more or less anything on if it's going to work on an acoustic or an electric guitar within reason. And the easiest way to put a request in is obviously comment in the comments below the video or if you want to find me a personal message over on those social media platforms I suggested at the start of the video you're very welcome to I just always point out that I do get quite a lot of requests and I do have to sort of you know hemp it them a little bit some things work and some things don't I'm sure you'll all appreciate that but uh, you know please do keep your requests coming because that's what keeps this channel going and it's very much appreciated another thing that's very much appreciated I'll quickly mention it again thank Thanks everyone who's subscribed and continues to do so. Now if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, a further way you could help me out and yourselves out by keeping up to date with the videos is hitting that little notification bell that's somewhere down there. The patron thing, sorry to keep banging on about it, but you want the chords, lyrics and the strumming pattern to not only this song, pretty much everything I've done over the past sort of uh, coming up to two years now, so there's a lot of content up there, there's a link to that in the comments, also a link in the description, I've got the super thanks link, sorry about all this pointing, it's just under the video there, it's another way that you can show some appreciation by making a small donation, again, very much appreciated, and it, I can promise you it all generally all goes back into the filming and the editing and the research of these videos, 
it's very time consuming I hope you all appreciate that so that's a way that you can you know show some appreciation another way that you can show some appreciation and this doesn't cost you a penny is by uh, you know if you dig what I do please like and share my videos tell your friends tell your work colleagues anyone you know plays a guitar please point them in my direction I really appreciate that so that just leads me to say whatever time of day it is you're watching whether it be morning day night thank you very much and I'll catch you all for lesson very soon take care